Acute esophageal variceal bleeding is a common complication of CLD and is a medical emergency. The management starts with securing two IV lines with large bore cannula and resuscitating the patient with isotonic fluids. Labs are simultaneously sent, especially to get the transfusion done. IV trolopressin is injected intermittently. It is a vasopressor analog and reduces portal pressure by reducing the blood flow. IV ceftriaxone is administered prophylactically due to the risk of superficial bacterial peritonitis is continued for seven days. The ultimate treatment is endoscopic band ligation, along with a PPI use which prevents bleeding due to banding-related ulceration. It has replaced sclerotherapy now, in which a sclerosing agent is injected. If banding fails or is unavailable, balloon tamponade by a Minnesota tube or TIPS procedure can be carried out. Once the patient has been stabilized, secondary prevention is carried out, which includes long-term beta-blocker therapy or endoscopic banding for two to three weeks until varices are obliterated. Thanks for watching.